Hey, what is going on, guys? This is Gotta Love Cotter Simps here, and today I'm bringing you guys the next installment of my Call of Duty Advanced Warfare Nate Spot series. Today we're going to be doing Riot. Uh, let's get right into this. So, this first Nate is going to hit up here, uh, top third. Um, if they're on defense, there's going to be a lot of spawn snipers up there. Uh, really annoying. It's really annoying to get first blooded like that. So, uh, to counter that, you spawn over here, you're going to want to run just through this door as if you're doing a simple A route, run right into this corner, you're going to look straight up and you're going to see as, of course, my phone goes off, right? Sorry about that. So anyways, uh, yeah, up here, you're going to see this uh, little thing right here and put your top crosshair in that. Throw your nade and it will land up there. Make sure you like stick to the left a little bit so that way it doesn't fall off. Um, if you do that, you should be fine and it'll land right up there and probably take out the spawn snipers. Just like that. Alright, so this next spot I have for you guys is up here, third story on the other side. It's the direct opposite of the one that we just did. Uh, kids like to either snipe up there or even just watch a push. Um, it, it all depends. Uh, kids just like to sit up there a lot. To take them out, what you want to do is come right over here down to second story, run into this corner like so, and you're going to look straight up. Now, there's a few like diamonds. The one like that you would honestly think is most practical if you were like trying to hit that nade is these two right here. So the one, two, three, fourth, and fifth. In between the fourth and the fifth diamond, uh, you just put your middle cross, uh, your bottom crosshair, sorry, on that, like in the uh, in the middle between the fourth and the fifth. Throw your nade. If you wanted to, you could cook it. That's probably the best way to go. If you cook it a little bit longer, it'll have to hit the nade. You see, the first one didn't hit. Uh, if you cook it a little bit, you have a much, much better chance of hitting the nade. So I'd recommend doing two cooks, and it'll hit them perfectly, like so. So uh, if you really wanted to, you could probably go with three cooks. It probably even hit better. So I mean, it's the next all. Next nade I got for you guys is here at A. Uh, pesky fucking dingbats will fucking come over here and try to plant. When you're on third story, they'll try to sneak by you, like kids hop in the border you have no idea what the fuck's gonna go on so what i would do is come right over here on this very very last uh pole i guess where the light is you want to come right up to that look straight up line your uh crosshairs with where it says a is just look as high as you possibly can and the nade will probably hit them right on a just like that uh, th this nade definitely is huge. I see uh, Crimzix use this nade. Not this exact nade, but uh, nade similar to it. And uh, it'll hit him like right in the head almost. So that's a guarantee. So this last kill. spot I have for you guys is over here at B when kids are going to be planting like so. Uh, there's an easy, easy counter to this. Um, you're going to want to come all the way back over here. Uh, preferably from the A rotation because, I mean, if you're at A, they're probably not going to be planting A. Uh, you're gonna be coming on the rotation. You'll probably have a kid third. You'll probably have a kid back here Maybe a kid from mid you, you have no idea how this is really gonna work But uh, I wouldn't be surprised if you send a kid over here near garage uh, With that being said you want to run right into this corner like I'm doing right now and you're gonna see up here uh, You're gonna want to put your top crosshair in that little pivot like that once you do that Just throw your nade and it'll land right on the b-bomb and it'll make a beautiful nade like so Hit him right off of B-Bomb, no sweats, boom bam, turkey, and ham. Either way, if you guys did enjoy, please make sure to leave a like. Um, that would be greatly appreciated. And uh, have a good one. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.